Hello. This is Piggy from Road Rules. Hey, how you doing? Good. I want to talk to you guys. Can you get everybody together and put me on speakerphone? Is everybody ready? Yeah. I'm Piggy from Road Rules Australia. We're going to challenge you to a Road Rules real world aqua game. <laughs> what? There's a package for you by the gate. You're skiing? Yeah. Call me Aquawoman. Oh! Let me! I'm even stinky! This is the true story of six people <laughs> picked to live on a pier. Work together. 107.78 Have their lives taped. To find out what happens when people stop being polite. <laughs> I'm getting real. The real world. Aqua Games. Hey, how you guys doing? I'm Mark. Kit. We're from Road Rules Uno. Today we're going to be the chairman of the board, so to speak, for the first real world Road Rules Aqua Games. You guys know it's always a competition. Who's better real world Road Rules? But we decided to put it to the test in the water in this gorgeous freezing weather. Whoever has the most points at the end of the day is going to win what, kid? $3,000! Yeah! Yeah! It's going to be a fight to the finish. So uh, stick around and enjoy the water. We'll see ya. Nice. I'm going to be representing the real world. Hey, hey, you guys ready? Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. And I'm going to be representing, of course, Road Rolls. I'm kidding. Yeah, we're gonna have a school time, bro. Oh. Steve, how you doing, buddy? Hey, my team is ridden crocodiles, all right? That's all I'm gonna say. Okay, elephants. We're gonna have you guys suit up and get ready for the first event. Nobody so. gets naked. You gotta come over this way. Being in Australia wrestling crocodiles, I'm sure we can wrestle these jokers. I'm not gonna talk trash. We're just gonna be quiet and nice, and afterwards, rubbing their nose in the sand after we win. <laughs> the first game we like to call Fast. Oh, oh Mama. We yeah. have four barrels, six swags, and a single length of rope. Each team must build a raft out of just this equipment. The first team to get their entire people, all six of them, on the boat, around the buoy, and back wins. One point. Go down the middle, tied in the middle, and tied yeah. in the end. Anybody looking for a date? Oh, no, that, yeah. No, no, no. We're, 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 we
They're swimming. We're pushing the boat. Mark, are you swimming? Are the judges here? Wait, wait, wait. We, we did the same here. thing. I have shrinkage. Oh. <laughs> From the commissioner way up above, they said that since their bodies were halfway underwater, nobody gets Thank any you. points. Thank you. What? You're what? kidding me. Who no, made that rule up? Because I'm looking to bust some heads. Zero. 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 If you could feel how cold that water was, you would give someone a point, wouldn't you? All right, guys, we're up to uh, game number two, which is called Kit. Dueling tubes. Exactly. We have two tubes behind a boat, one member of each team on each of the tubes. If you're knocked off or you leave your tube, you lose. You lose. We're starting off at square one. It's an even ball game. All right, so decide who's going against who. Give me, give me the strongest one, so I'll just let me the sacrificial lamb. <laughs> <laughs> right, you have to be nice to me, though, because I'm very weak. Are we happy with this? <laughs> I got kicked in the face. Um, the uh, pick from Kifa, the southern gentleman here. I got your footprint. Oh my God. Go, go. Are you ready to get wet? Come on. I gave one of their opponents a swift kick to the ear already, so I'm sure another swift kick to the head or the jaw wouldn't matter. one of your opponent's face. Did he really Blue hold to that? Their face. But now comes my favorite and kids also. It's the blindfolded canoe. On your mark! Get set! Go! You pick two people from your team to do the blindfolded canoe. Two people will be in there with the sporty goggles and then their teammates will yell from the shore. Left! Susie, Left. the other Susie, side of the boat! Susie, go right! right. Go. Back! You gotta go out there and 
can get one animal off of each of these posts and get them back here. The first one to do that wins. This is worth another whopping one point. Can you believe they tipped the canoe over? My fingers, I can't feel them again. My other treat came like saying things for me. Yeah, they were yelling. That was so hurtful because I was totally listening. My fingers. Oh my God, they're so swollen. Then it takes care of me. For the third event, road roll. We're up to the fourth game. Extreme fishing. This next event is worth two points. So we can catch up, guys. Come on, road fools. We're down two, and this could tie it. So. We're coming along. I mean, it, the board speaks for itself. Two to zero. Feeling good about things. And you know what? We're going to kick ass. It's going to be 100 sharks out there. Every fish has to be scooped up nice. with the net. Honey, don't mean. There's goldfish out there. If you get the goldfish, it's worth a crisp $100 cash. Nice. Don't drop. Don't drop. Push them up against me. Stop leaning. Nice. Go back. Go back. Oh, no. Yeah, we love this terrible. Oh. Oh. Grab the gold hey. one at least. Yeah, <laughs> I should have scooped. Yeah. 16, 17, 18. And does the gold count as 19? 19. 19 and a big crisp. Shots at the bar. You got the goal. Hey, you got 19 to 7. All right, guys, if you take a look here, if the real world doesn't win this fifth event, it's ball game because ball that's going to be impossible for them to win. And our fifth event is called the zip off. You're going right. to get on that pulley thing and jump off into the three rings there. The small ring is three points. The middle ring, two points. And the large ring, one point. Right. Real worlders. You this need is this. crucial. You need this or it's ball game. I'm freezing my ass off. This water is not exactly warm. This is ridiculous. This is the dumbest thing I've ever, ever had to do in my life. At least you're not bitter. Um, I'm a little bitter about being up here. I don't want to go at all, but I thought. If I could go first and get it over with, it would be all right. But it's not looking good from up here. You got it, Sue. If you're really scared, wait till it hits that tree on the other side. <laughs> Maybe someone else should go first. Oh. Someone else go first. Oh. oh, my God. Someone has got to go first. Oh, God. Um. What are you being scared of? You want to slow down? down? OK, then just climb down. down. But be careful. <laughs> I don't even know you, but don't worry about it. You're a bigger person to come back down than just go on something you don't want to do. Don't sweat. Piggy! 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 Go Piggy! Go Piggy! Wait, you're going to hit the dog. Oh, my God. Pull up rather than jump off. My hands weren't strong enough to hold me for any longer, and I, I, I was really scared. Hey, I can't believe you even went. Come on. I didn't want to go, man. Girls couldn't do the zip line just because there's not enough weight and the rope was really wet. The deal is, ladies, because you are so slender, you will not be jumping because of the weight factor. I did it! I Very did high, it! Right? What do you say, big one or little one? Yeah. Hey, big guy, remember me? I'm sorry I didn't go to church last Sunday, but uh, I'll make it up to you. Black man, cold as <laughs> on a platform trying to jump in the water when it's raining. Man, 
all I can think about is that I have to urinate like you would not believe. It's my motivation up here to get down and then go to the restroom. It's five to three. All we need is a two right now, and we're going in the next round, and we can win this. Nathan, you need two, and it's over. It's on to the beach bungee pool. It's my turn, Our actual first victory in any of the games today. We had to we had to make the two to win, and I didn't think I was going to make it. I was swinging, and somehow I just fell right into it. All right, let's break it down for him. All right, guys. After the fifth event, the zip off. My crew, my team, the real world has pulled through and get two points, which means we're going to have to go to a sixth event. Kid, what is it? The beach bungee bowl. But here's the deal: because of the points. The bull is worth four points, which means there will be no tie. There can be no tie. Whoever wins this is taking home the cash prize worth... Three thousand dollars! Let's take it to the bull. Mm. We got a chance to win, and hopefully our sexually repressed women will ride that bull like it ain't no other, so... Listen up, you listen up. ready for the finale event? This it's next event, event the wire. each team is going to put pick two riders to ride the bull where the other team members are going to have four guys shaking and shaking. I got a nice little hat and vest up here for you. You're going to strap this on and we're going to combine the time. Two players combined two time. So what's Winner four points takes next? all. Are we ready to ride? This is the big shebang. All the money is on the line. Put the women and kids to bed. Let's go looking for dinner, boys. When I'm on the bull, all you have to do is squeeze, pretend it's someone you love. Lindsay's got big thighs. She's like Quadzilla. She sticks him and holds it tight. And she's like, oh, she's riding it. All right, Lindsay was on the bull for 5.22 seconds. 11.46 is oh, time to be. All right, rider number two. We could have a little dingling action because he's riding in his boxer. So. My pants are too slippery. Get ready for showtime. What I got, fellas? Check out Derek Dingler. Ow! His tongue. Do this. Bring you up. Oh, oh, get it off for one second. I can see his stuff. My thing is coming out like a champ. <laughs> Damn, I got some white thighs, America. This is for the cash prize. Yeah. Three grand is riding on the Let's go! Get set, go! bitter as hell, man. <laughs> I'm bitter as pickles, salt, and lemon hairs all combined. Ah, the exuberance. Wonderful. My team bagged us. We did everybody did a wonderful job. Luckily, I just got some strong white-ass legs. Got that. <laughs> Hang on to that bowl. Outstanding job by everyone today. That was unbelievable. Yeah, good job, good guys. Good job, guys. 
go have a shower. All right. Let's go. Uh, hey, goodbye, goodbye. 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 On the next real world. There's no place like home. There's no place like home. Time's winding down at the house, and Stephen's been given a new perspective. Stephen's totally changed the result of all this. It's not about Irene anymore. It's about me dealing with my actions. But when he's pushed, will he push back? Stu wants to start a fight with me inside. Find out on the season finale of The Real World Seattle. <laughs>